Hey guys, it's Crystallize and I'm going to show you how to make Haku from Spirited Away. And as usual, the materials will be in the description box below. So I started with the wire to make a skeleton for his skull and I just kind of did it and wrapped a bunch of wire everywhere to see what best fit his face. And then I started doing the paper mache and I cut a bunch of pieces of paper I don't need anymore. And then I made my own paste, which is literally flour and water. And then I just started adding the pieces on once I dipped it in. So then I added some tin foil because I needed more support and once the paper mache dried out I popped the balloon and I added more tin foil after that and now it looks more how the shape that I wanted. So I got polymer clay and I did his nose and his teeth. And my dogs decided to join me. And be all cute. And once I was done with the teeth, I painted them all white. So next is the fur and I just cut all the pieces I needed and how I wanted them before I glued them on. So here I'm just showing that I picked a corner and I cut it diagonally and then I'm showing you how I'm going to cut it and glue it on the bottom. So with this top piece, I like the color, but I didn't like the stripes that were on it. So I took off the stripes so I get the color that I originally wanted on there. Now for the side of the mouth, you're going to want to make sure the fur is going down and you're going to cut the top and then it's going to look like this and then you're going to glue it all on the side of the mouth. So right here I started gluing everything together and this is in the order that I did it in. I started gluing all the teeth in his mouth. For his ears, I cut a triangle and then the bottom I made it round so it can curve nicely in. Then I glued it in. Once 
once you hot glue gun the ears you're gonna start the horns and what I did is I just cut a skinny triangle all the way to the top and to adjust it to how long I want his horns to be Once you have both pieces done, you're going to sew it, but as usual, you're going to leave the bottom open so you can turn it inside out and stuff it in. Once you're done with the horns, you're going to want to hot glue gun them to his head. I got this from Hobby Lobby and it fit perfect for Haku's back, well back of the head and I just cut it and glued it onto his head. Now for Haku's eyes, this took me forever, this is why I didn't post the video like I said I would after the vlog because I had a hard time with his eyes. But anyways, I drew it first and then I cut it out. And then I matched it with felt so it would match my drawing and then I made sure they both matched so they don't look uneven and then I glued it onto his eye uh, to his head <laughs> And we're all finished. Here's a tutorial I've been promising, and I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks for watching. Bye.